Hello everyone, this is Game Frost, and today's video is going to be a new um, review video. So basically what I'm going to be doing now is be do I'm going to start doing tech reviews. Now basically what I'm what I'm going to review today is the Sharper Image Bluetooth speaker. So basically this has been a sample Bluetooth speaker that has been given to me by a friend and I'm not going to lie, it was pretty good. All I had to do was basically modify the speaker um, using Viper for Android FX. If you guys don't know what that is, you guys can check it out, but you all, but you need root. So we're just gonna check out what this um, Bluetooth speaker can do, and yeah, let's get started. So, the Sharper Image Bluetooth speaker is basically one of the low-end or middle kind of class speakers. It's not the best speaker. I don't think it has the loudest volume, but what I'm actually intrigued about the spe speaker is its features. So, basically, if I can turn it around here, you can actually see right here the USB charging port and the... Uh, the, um, the audio jack if where you can actually like you know plug in the audio jack to your phone to the Bluetooth speaker if you if your phone doesn't support Bluetooth unexpectedly um, another feature that this Bluetooth uh, speaker has is actually this so as you can see you see this right here so if I put my finger right here you see this this right here is actually the microphone so basically the speaker is also acts like a microphone so if somebody's calling you um, there's actually going to be a ring on this um, speaker and and then you can like probably press the power button to actually like retrieve it so the power button and volume buttons are right here the thing about the speaker is that uh, it does have a kickstand I have been using this speaker for like a few months probably like maybe five to six months probably more I, ha I didn't keep track I really like how the speaker does have a kickstand but this is not what we're aiming for. What we're actually aiming for is basically how well it can do. So the first thing we're gonna do is power it on. So all I need to do is just press the power button right here. So as you can see, you can hear a sound. Um, I when it makes a beep like that, um, actually it's connected to my phone. Uh, it also has a a, a play forward button. So basically, if you have music. And you want to play forward without you know pressing your phone screen well, you could just press that button it'll just play another music so we're gonna show you how well it can run so let's get started all right so we're going to see this speaker in action um, I'm not gonna put this speaker in full volume because I'm gonna show you how much um, how loud the speaker actually is without full volume so uh, I'm going to bring down the music so it's basically any music I, I retrieved one which is actually a race driver grid which is um it's menu music which is a very chill loud music I, it's one of my favorites so far and it's one of my favorite video games you know racing video games it's pretty nice so I'm, I'm just gonna let you guys hear it so let's get started now make sure i'm just telling you this is actually not on the highest preset so basically um, i'm not using the full volume of my phone so yeah now the thing about the speaker i think that it can probably last up to like maybe three four hours if it was utilized like at full volume so that's a pretty good amount so if you're basically listening to music for like 3-4 hours, um, this is basically the ideal speaker for you. Um, so let's try it on high now. Oh, I kind of made a mistake there. Um, so as you can see, it's really loud, but to just tell you that it also has a volume of speakers so we can even make this even louder watch this So as you can see, 
this speaker which was modified by basically Viper 4 Android FX um, you can basically achieve like you know a higher frequency you can achieve basically higher volume um, sharper image this um, if you just want the speaker um, for your room I think this is the best thing because if you're trying to leave it out in the public like let's say uh, where there's a lot of people talking and stuff it's this is not gonna give you enough sound this speaker is only made for like if you're in like a room and just want to listen to chill music or any other music this is basically the speaker for you because any other speaker out there like high-end ones they could produce loud sound even in their pocket but this one is really not enough but if you want to get the speaker only for your room I think this is the option for you um, but I really love the features. I know how it only has three features and a kickstand, or probably four features because, uh, you know, the playback thing. But overall, the speaker is pretty good, for, in my opinion. It's only, it's like literally my only Bluetooth speaker right now. But yeah, so if you guys like this video, I hope you can leave a thumbs up. If you want to check out my Discord channel, you can also um, join that. The description will be in the, in the, the title. Uh, what they call it, the link will be in the description below, sorry about that. And if we can hit 50 subscribers, that would be greatly, greatly appreciated. I hope you guys have a great day, and yeah, see you on the next review video.